Greetings, Cropture here, and this is Raid Shadow Legends free to play challenge for 2024. Uh, challenge is powered by Team Hal Hades, and let's take a look where we are today. So, level 54, login day 41. Okay, so today what I would like to show is um, Retalos and his build and how he's performing now because I've changed it a little bit. So let's quickly take a look. So Retalos, he's here. Yeah, uh, so what was my plan? Uh, because uh, recently we had this uh, forge pass for Retalos set, uh, so I decided uh, to wait with forging the gear until the end uh, when you get this those um, i think the most valuable pieces for five and six star yeah so i'm just my, my currently vault is empty i don't have any because i forge everything uh, so i have few uh, good pieces i would say so let's quick take a look um, so that's what I have I upgraded many of them during the enhance uh, artifact enhancement uh, event yeah just to test them and try what's going on so after that I managed to choose uh, some items um, that I think it will work on him and looks like they are working pretty fine uh, so the current setup is like this. So we got uh, six piece uh, of Rotalos set, uh, which is adding a lot of bonuses. So we got additional 15 for uh, crit rate, 15% for crit damage, 5% for speed, uh, additional turmeter fear for uh, for AOE attacks, and ignoring 30% uh, of enemy defense. Which is huge, so that's what I wanted to achieve. Uh, yeah, so 7 piece would be even greater, so additional 15% of crit damage, but yeah, um, the build uh, <laughs> you, you cannot have everything what you want. <laughs> uh, so, let's like, quickly take a look. Uh, so, the most important thing I've got this lucky uh, critical damage uh, mm, this is amulet. Uh, for him, which is Descent, with some additional attack and accuracy, which is cool. Uh, banner, this is unfortunately the de defensive banner, but uh, so perfect scenario will be to have an attack uh, banner. Uh, but this one got one attack uh, percentage here, which I added some glyphs, so it's, so it's 10 additional percent. So 6 speed, yeah, something like that. So rank is very very bad, <laughs> only three stars. So I don't have any rings. So I need to go back to Spider and far farm some rings um, for him. But it is what it is at this moment. Uh, what I have here uh, boots. So I've decided to put on him attack percentage boots with some additional attack and speed. So yeah. It rolled everything, <laughs> unfortunately, yeah, but it is what it is, as usual. Um, shield, well, only speed with without any rolls, but got two rolls uh, to critical damage, so additional 15 here. And besides that, yeah, some accuracy. Accuracy is good for, for the brimstone. Um, yeah. But if I would like to change uh, the blessing to something else, so accuracy is not needed. Mm, so here we got some on the helm, uh, on the helmet, uh, some crit rate, uh, crit damage, attack. Yeah, unfortunately unlucky with the last roll, so resistance. I would like to have some speed here. Um, for the weapon, good attack. And no rolls to the crit damage, yeah, because this was last, this is epic. So besides that, no, nothing useful. So those uh, pieces are not perfect, but that's the best what I uh, could use here. Uh, so to um, speed up him a little bit, so I decided to choose uh, <coughs> two pieces from the speed set. So we got here uh, crit gloves um, with the attack, and generally that's all. 
so no, cr no crit damage, no speed, so uh, this is potential item to, to, to replace if I will get something better. Um, chest plate, chest plate with attack percentage. This one is pretty decent, I would say, but yeah, so got three, four stats that are, that are needed, but the, uh, the last one defense, yeah, you could replace at some uh, point. Yeah, so that's the item, so let's take a look to his stats. Uh, so we got this um, attack, so 40, uh, 400. Uh, attack, pretty decent one, I would say. Um, I was lucky with uh, those uh, stats here. Speed 160, it's not the best, he's very slow, I would say. Crit rate is over the cap, so that's that's the setup. Currently I have, perfect is 100%, but yeah, as a general, I'm losing this additional 11%. And crit damage 160 one so where i am getting 10 uh, from masteries and six from affinity bonuses from the arena yeah so then that's how he looks um, and uh, now let's time for for some action and see uh, let's check how he's performing so now what i'm doing is i'm running uh, <coughs> minotaur because I need to put some uh, masteries uh, for Ancora, um, Mordecai and Coffin Smasher. So let's take a look how the fight looks like. Because he's uh, the slowest one, so Mordecai will put uh, the burn and he will increase the attack. And now Ratalos is doing over 100 uh, damage. Uh, with his AoE. So 28k damage as a single hit. But we will see how he performs on the uh, boss, so the Minotaur. So he, his best damage uh, will be shown if uh, the boss will have decreased uh, defense, of course. That's okay, so that was the hit. So almost half of a million damage hit. Uh, so you need to have increased attack and uh, burn on the <coughs> target. So then you will see those big numbers, which is, I would say, pretty impressive. Um, but I've, his, uh, his build is not perfect yet. Of course, the, there are some uh, rooms, to, uh, there is room to, for the improvements. But so far, I'm happy with this build, I would say. Um, but what else is going on? So recently we got this Blade Master Titan event, uh, and in the rewards we see that there are some additional um, stars that we can get for Ratalos. And I'm thinking uh, that two star is must have, at least. Uh, so if you have uh, energy and time, just do it. It should be pretty straightforward. Um, and let me explain why. So my current uh, numbers in terms of attack is uh, 4400. So if I will get uh, for him uh, blessing with better stats, so for example here, I will get additional uh, 750 additional attack which is which is a lot uh, it uh, so it means that uh, Rattles will have more than 5000 attack which is huge uh, so big wishes is uh, to get this additional uh, crit damage on the four star but it will be more expensive and energy consuming not sure if I will go for that Mm, yeah, but but that's also which will uh, boost his damage a lot. So additional almost 40% uh, for the critical damage. It, so it could mean that I will have uh, so uh, 750. Yeah, um, over over. Uh, so it will be like 5200 uh, of attack and almost 200 critical damage. So. 
I could potentially with the hit that I presented, uh, I, I could one hit, <laughs> uh, one shot uh, Minotaur. Yeah, so what's going on? Um, currently we have this uh, turn attack for the Fire Knight. And I would like to show you what, what is my plan here. So Fire Knight turn attack. This one is a little bit different. So this is turn attack tournament, not standard tournament. So the idea is here to deal with uh, the stages in the fewer turns of, of, as possible, right? Uh, so let's quickly take a look. So that's the table with the points. So here, um, what I decided to do is uh, to run uh, on the stage eight, uh, my guys here, and to get those points. And why stage eight? Stage eight, because uh, the boss on the stage eight uh, do not have a lot of uh, health and my team will deal with him pretty easily but let me grab some energy to show something solution 50 okay so dungeons fire knight and stage 8 so as you probably can see here so best time 14 seconds uh, lowest turn count 6 which is great so cost for the energy is uh, 12 and so that's the setup so Ratalos with the uh, attack uh, increasing the dungeon bar 30 percent my campaign farmer and two uh, champs with uh, a1 free hitters so and they are all faster than Ratalos right so below one hit and those two guys uh, for free hits uh, and on this stage, uh, Fire Knight uh, will have a shield with uh, three, um, not three, seven, uh, seven stacks. So let's slow it down. So below where with AoE, just clean the wave. So turn count one, so turn count two. Another wave is done. So now, yeah, shield with seven. Okay, Phantom Touch. Now Coffin Smasher with three hits. Now 8 all with 3 hits, so shield is down. And now Ratalos with 8 2, so he will ignore all the defense. And generally, job done. Right, so got uh, 23 points uh, for this tournament uh, for 12 energy. Which, uh, in terms of calculation, uh, I think it's, it's looking pretty good in terms of efficiency, right? Because I don't want to spend a lot of energy to complete this uh, tournament, but I want to get this uh, additional 50 uh, fragments for Atalos Souls. Yeah, so I, what I calculated, it should took me, it will take me like 700 energy, which is less than one day. So daily you, you are getting 1000 energy. Uh, so this is not huge investment to get uh, those 15 points which will be good and today also we got this uh, event dungeon divers event so here this is like double dipping right so getting the artifacts will just move this bar to get uh, blade master points here so we got 30 here 70 here and 100 here so yeah i will finish uh, so that's my plan i will finish uh, fire knight with the less effort that possible and then we will have a spider uh, turn attack tournament and uh, i will put there a lot of energy just to get some silver on stage 10 and train some champions uh, yeah so generally that will be the plan yeah so i aiming mean to at least to get this uh, two star uh, blessing with the less effort as possible and then we will see uh, if I will go further or not because my main priority now is to get uh, masteries for um, those three champions and this is a lot of energy <laughs> needs to be spent in the uh, Minotaur
So if it was helpful, helpful, useful, if you like it, please consider hitting the like and subscribe and see you in the next one. Cheers.